we're good. Hello, guys. Hey, guys. Happy hump day. Oh, no. Today's more than today's hump day. Thursday. Today's Thursday. Tomorrow's Friday. It's Friday Eve. All right. So, unfortunately, Kaki Doo is still sick. And, um... She's not going to be able to taste anything, so she wasn't going all out. Um, yeah, I'm just having soup and grilled cheese. That's well, it's it. more than a grilled cheese. It's a bagel twist grilled cheese, which... Yeah, she's still not going to be able to taste it, so I don't know why the hell I made it. Um, I can't hear out of this ear because I'm so congested. <sighs> Story of my life. I'm shocked I made it through my whole shift at work today. I told you just skip dinner tonight. I'm shocked I made it through my whole shift at work because I honestly wanted to go home. Yeah. Like... It's the point where, like, I can't taste or smell anything, and I thought I had COVID. So I took a COVID test. It was negative. Thank God. But still, this shit sucks. Yeah. I feel I'm, like crap. I'm telling you, I'm going to get it. I'm going to get it this weekend. Hello, Jacqueline. Hello, Abby. I don't think that you will. You never get sick. I guess it's my healthy diet. <laughs> <laughs> wink, wink. All right, so I've got Rodeo Smash Burgers. And, um, anybody remember these hot fries? I bought them for my son last week. He never ate them, so they've been in the freezer ever since. Uh, a rodeo burger is one of Burger King's dishes. It's a cheeseburger. Love a rodeo burger. Yeah, it's cheeseburger, barbecue sauce, and onion rings. That's it. No lettuce, no tomato, none of that, none of that happy stuff. So, my meal is also very simple. Um, I'm, I'm very hungry, so... Uh, yeah, I can't wait to get into this. I'm gonna drink my uh, my smoothie and then get into <laughs> get into business. What's up, Muscle Dumper? Hello, Jamie. Hello, Hello Muscle Up Runner, not Muscle Dumper. Got your name right. Hello, Mama Llama, Jamie Curly, Kelly, <sighs> Abby, Kelly. I didn't uh, say we, hello to Kelly. We don't talk politics. <sighs> yeah, no Rich politics. Rich Golden. We don't do that here. No politics. No religion. Nope. That seems to bring the mood down, right? It does. Um, it's going to piss somebody off regardless what we say. And truth be told, we really don't. Truth We're be not told, into I don't got a freaking opinion. Yeah. Hello from Oregon. Hello, Liz. Hello from Same Oregon. Wings. Do a wrestling move. I'm about to eat dinner. That's going to be my wrestling move. What's up, Albert? Can I have one Jamie Rollins? I would give you one. Cartoonist Cowboy, hello. Actually, there's, there's three of these and a basket of hot fries. Bah. But I have been I have not been eating a lot. Um, last night I had the salad sandwiches. The night before I had the quesadillas, which I only ate one. Um, I'm hungry tonight. What's up, Stu? Life's a stage. You are correct on that. Life is a stage. How much does it mean if your face is that what you're saying? I don't know what that means. What the means. hell does that mean? Potato up is good. Potato soup is good. We don't have potato soup. I have tomato soup. No, I did not make it. It came from a can. I wasn't that adventurous. I don't feel very well. I'm adventurous. One to ten, if you saw these burgers, where do you think I'm going with this? Oh, I know they're probably going to be good. I want to bite one, but it's pointless because I can't taste it. Oh, shit. I'm sure it was good. I've never. Sure. Wow. I'm nailing my pizza with the seasonings and the cheese blend, and I've also been nailing my burgers with the seasoning. 8.5. What's up, Eric? Hey, guys. Haven't been here in a while. Kaki looks amazing. Jamie, what's up, bud? Oh, not much, Eric. How are mm, you? Thank you, Eric. No, thank you for that. Appreciate it. What's up, Jacob? Those rodeo burgers are bomb, I can tell. They're very good. Oh, man. I honestly don't know why I'm eating, because I can't taste it. Are you hungry, though? I'm hungry, but I can't taste it, so what the hell is the point? The best thing about you, you, is you never skimp out on ingredients. 
dunk one in khaki soup. No. I wouldn't want, no. This is so good as it is. What is the green drink that you're drinking? That you were drinking? Those are my vegetables. Holy shit. I really knocked it out of the park. And I overcooked my burgers, but you wouldn't even be able to tell. I don't think you'd be able to tell. No, I was worried about it because I shut the pizza maker, which when it comes to making burgers on there, if you shut it, it keeps the heat inside and it cooks it from both sides and I don't ever want to do that. I wasn't thinking and I accidentally did it. Grilled cheese and tomato soup, yes for me. But I can't taste it, so I'm not going to eat it. I'm just going to sit here and drink my wine. Can't taste the wine either, but... I'm just going to live my life and exist at this point until I can actually taste shit. You need sleep, can No, I don't need sleep. I just need to feel better. Are you going to watch SmackDown? Yeah. I mean, I plan on it. I never... I never, you know, um, plan on not watching wrestling. It all depends on, like, what's going on in the house. Who, you know, who's up, who's hanging around. On a perfect night, I'll start SmackDown around 8.45. My, my problem is I don't record SmackDown and Raw. Unless it's a show I'm definitely going to be wanting to watch. So, 9 out of 10 times I forget and I lose track of time. Yeah, Rebecca, I'm sick. Again. For like the umpteenth fucking time. Hey, Dustin. Brother, I had no idea you were a wrestler. Oh, yeah. Once upon a time, Dusty. I could still do it. Just saying. You've been feeling rough for about a week, plugged up, no taste, yeah. I don't have COVID, I took a test, but, you know. Once your nose is stuffed, you can't taste anything. Because all that crap's connected, so. You're just screwed. And I know this probably tastes really good. What, yours? Yeah. Um. You want to taste this part, you can taste, I didn't contaminate that part. I know that's probably really good. That's smoked white cheddar cheese and a freaking toasted bagel. Toasted cheddar bagel. Oh, I know. I saw. I'm sure it's delicious. I knew it was a special twist. I just can't taste it. My son is huge into all outside of the trampoline doing crazy moves. Yeah, that's how I was when I was little, too. Dusty, how'd you, fi how'd you, figure, how'd you figure it out that I used to wrestle? I mean, I love talking about it. You'll never see me um, try to get away from talking about my wrestling days. Um, I'm just curious how you figured it out. What's up, John? Hello, John. How are you? You want to try mine? I can't taste it. It's pointless. I'm sure it's delicious. I this just is can't so taste flavorful, it. you probably would. No, I, I can't taste anything. I couldn't even taste a potato chip on here. I couldn't even taste the salt on a potato chip. I can't taste shit. NyQuil and hot tea. Yeah, NyQuil. Mm. I have my NyQuil. It's right here. My NyQuil. And then I have to wake up and go to work tomorrow. I think you should. I think attempt to make it through the day. No, nope, I'm doing it. You know why? Because I already, did it today. They already know that you're sick. Yeah, but I did it today. I'm doing it again tomorrow, and I'll do it again Saturday. You know what's crazy is, um... Well, for feeling like shit, girl, you're looking good. Aw. Thank you, Rebecca. I appreciate that. Thank you so much. <laughs> It Thank felt, you. It felt like a September day today. It was like chilly. It's oh, chilly out right super now. Super chilly. What kind of question is that, Albert? Nothing's ever better than pizza oh. in Jamie's eyes. I've been nailing my burgers and I've been nailing my pizza, right? I have a pizza recipe. I now have a burger recipe when it comes to seasonings, um, and the last three times, four times, or both of them, I've done really good. So, it's just a matter of mixing I up. I wish I could taste, because I know damn well that's probably like the best tasting burger you probably made. 
It's pretty good. F my life. That's all I'm gonna say is F my it's life. Pretty, it's, it's pretty the damn good. The only life. thing I didn't add to it was <sighs> bacon. What's up, Rebecca? Oh, cold here too. You're from Canada. Nice. Someone mentioned something about wrestling, and I was like, hold up. So I looked it up after I saw that. Yeah, I mean, I'm. <clears throat> I never would have thought that you were, um, I mean, I said, I know you said your son liked wrestling, but I'm imagining you probably enjoy watching it, too. Hello, Victor. Do you only eat once a day? Yep. Oh, it was on your last live or the comment on the video. Man, if I can get back 20 years. Hmm. And not be afraid of getting hurt. I'd be all over it. Hello, Mama Pert. How you doing, girl? Hey, hey. Ho, ho. How are you doing, Mama Pert? Did you start your new job yet? She did. She said that last night. Or like the night before. One of those nights. I thought she said she was going to be starting. I thought she said she started. <laughs> uh, Jacqueline... Kaki, did you like wrestling before you knew Jamie? Um, no. Um, do I still like it? No. Huh. But do I watch it with Jamie? Yes. Do I love a live show? Absolutely. Live shows are my favorite. I don't like watching it on TV. I don't think that's fun. But I love going to a live show. Yeah. I am good. I started on Tuesday. Thank you. Yeah, I knew that you started. I remember you saying you started. I thought you said you were, everything went well and you are getting ready to start. No. She started early. Do you drink just water while you're fasting all day? I know that's good, but I can't do it. Sometimes. Sometimes I don't drink any water at all. Actually, I did have a bottle. I had a half a bottle of water today. What did you make? Oh, Rudy wow. Or Someone gave it to me. I had like six bottles of water today. Mark says, we always watch wrestling, even if it sucks and it's bad and boring. It's like an addiction. Yeah, exactly. But I'm just happy wrestling is booming. I'm happy it's exciting to watch and yo. You don't know what's going to happen. <sighs> do you remember Ricky Steamboat? Of course I do. Isn't that like one of your favorite wrestlers? No. Well, no. I, oh, I'm thinking of somebody else. Never mind. Ricky Steamboat? Tugboat? Tugboat? Steamboat, Tugboat. Sorry, I got confused. Tugboat was one of my favorites when I was little. And it still held well, a very special place in my heart. Oh, hello, Jamie. Um, I liked Ricky Steamboat, but he was not a childhood favorite. Hey, Jamie. Wasn't expecting that, actually. Someone's, Albert, someone told me, left a comment saying that she was going to steal the show, which she did not. But it was better than I expected it to be. I thought Tony Storm and Serena Deem had a better match. You making homemade pizza tonight? Very nice, D. Good for you. Hey, Jamie, my wife let me, left me last week. Any advice on keeping this mindset right? I'm sorry to hear that, Jacob. Um, man, I wish I could give you like something positive to say about that. But um, I don't know what to say. You know, and I don't want to just say something for the matter of saying something. Um, I'm sorry to hear that. Flair for life? Not one of my favorites at all. Who's your top five favorite wrestlers of all time? Macho Man, Shawn Michaels, Bret Hart, Brian Pillman. Who is that that keeps pushing on me? Molly. Owen Hart. Knock it off. Are you in house arrest? Why are you blowing up my spot? Man? Oh my god. Come on. I man. can't. Nope, Stone Cold, not for me. 
So what, you don't like it or you just can't taste it? I can't taste it, so why the hell am I going to eat it? If you're hungry, I mean... You oh, not... <clears throat> I mean, I'm hungry, but why am I going to eat something that I can't taste? I'm just going to drink my wine. Can I taste it? Eh, not really, but I know it's going to at least make me feel a little bit better. The Instagram comments asks that constantly about what house arrest? I know. I know. Trust me, I know. The house arrest things don't bother me. Yeah, John, I'm not feeling well. I'm sick again. Peggy's got like some kind of freaky cold. I have the same damn thing your dad has. It's his fault. It's his damn fault. He started it. I caught it. You know what? I catch everything these days. I turned 40 and I started falling freaking apart. That's how I feel. Jackie, you've been getting sick before you were 40. No, but like once I... Since February, I have been consistently sick since February. It's freaking almost June. Yeah, well... Think I'm over come. it. I'm over it. When is this, John? John said he's thinking of coming to New York. Me and Kaki might be going to Connecticut in two weeks. Taste out. Uh, try some. Um, try some. Um, Connecticut New Haven pizza. Wooster Street freaking pizza. Wooster. Wooster Street. I don't even know how to say it. With my Long Island accent. You sound sick. That's because I am. <laughs> That's because I am. I do not have COVID-24 or COVID-19 or COVID-23 or 21 or 22. I tested negative for COVID. What about the ABC? I might have the COVID ABC. Yeah, just, yeah. I don't think they make tests for that one just yet. I might have the COVID ABC. I might have the COVID-123. Who knows? You leave for Tennessee tomorrow for a vacation? Lucky you. That's how you were until they finally gave you prednisone. Listen, I was on prednisone. I was on prednisone like a month ago. Didn't do that, Jacob. Freaking cleared me up. One, two, three. Felt great for a couple of weeks. And then boom. <sighs> Jamie's dad got sick. And then guess what? I got sick. Because my immune system sucks. <laughs> You know what the problem is with, like, <laughs> having a big family is great, right? you never by yourself. You always got someone to talk to. But at least once a month, there's someone there's sick. There's somebody that's fucking sick. And I'm over it. And you know what? The minute that somebody sneezes, I'm the one that gets sick. It's always me. Except for whenever you guys got that freaking virus where you guys were throwing up. I did not get that. Why did I not get the puking virus? Don't know. Uh -huh. Get everything else. Don't get the puking virus. When was that? That was February. We went like a month where we were back and forth sick. Our daughter caught the flu back in February before my birthday. But prior to that, everybody was puking. Everybody got the puking virus except for me. And I was gloating. I'm like, oh, I'm drinking my lemon water. I'm not going to uh -huh. get sick. Blah, blah, blah. I'm not puking. And then what happens? I caught the flu. And after the flu, I caught the freaking influenza virus in my damn eye. My eye flew, swelled shut. And I looked like freaking sloth from the Goonies. And then after that, I got sick again. I got sick again. And I got sick again. And guess what? Now I'm sick again because you wash your hands. I wash my hands constantly. I'm a psychopath when it comes to washing my hands. Uh, that's the exact reason why I don't want to work in the office anymore after working from home. How did my man Jamie Rollins never get sick running barefoot in the Crocs in 20 degree <laughs> yeah, well, well, Jamie's built different. <laughs> but when Jamie gets sick... <laughs> I'm a big baby. Oh my God. I can't. When Jamie's sick, he just like curls up into a ball. The room is like, ah. You miss your savvy? Yeah. Like if Jamie felt how I felt today, he wouldn't have gone to work. He would have just laid in bed all day. I went you don't to work. Know that. I went to work. You don't sucked know that. it up. I do know that. You don't know that. I go to work sick all the time. I go. To, I don't go to work. 
I felt if today, I felt today like I had COVID. That's why I came home and took a COVID test because my body was killing me. My uh, body was aching. That's why I came home and took a COVID test because that's how I felt. That's how shitty I felt. Well, it's not COVID. It's just the freaking viral crap that I'm going through. Yeah. Yes, I'm sick, Lisa Marie. You know, my dad's taking some antibiotics, I think. No, he's not. They did not give him... It's viral. They oh. can't give him antibiotics. They told him to take vitamin C. Right. Like, I'll admit... I'll admit, when I get sick, my mom and Kaki both take very good care of me. Um... And I'm a, I'm a little bit of a baby. But that's if I'm, like, hurting. A little bit? I'm a big baby. But that's only if, like, if, and, and, and you know, if I don't go to work, it's because I don't, I'm so sick, I don't give a fuck what, what happens. And that's just a text message. It, Thank you, Muzzy. Right you know, no, no nothing, just, like, truth be told, like, I'm sick, I'm not coming in today. And I don't give two shits what they say back. That's how I know I'm really sick. I only went in because I've been off since... I was off for five days. And now I'm sick. So I didn't want to call out. So I went in sick. And even my, my one boss was just like... What's up, Knox? He was like, wow. Are you feeling okay? I'm like, no. I am not feeling okay. I'm sick. I just didn't want to call out. He's <laughs> just like, well, thank you for coming in while you're sick. I'm like, I don't think you'll be thanking me in a couple of days when you're sick. <laughs> don't think you'll be thanking me then because that shit's contagious. Will you and the <laughs> other older wrestlers have a big gathering anytime, like a reunion on a live TV? It'd be great. No. The guys that I know that are on TV, um... I don't talk to them no more, and they, I don't want to say that, there's like a couple of them that would remember me, but for the most part, um, I was never on TV. You're not somebody that's forgettable, though. Uh, You're not. No. <sighs> not fun to be around people when you're contagious? Are you contagious? Yeah. Yeah, I know. It's not funny. But my bosses didn't care. They're like, thanks for coming in. Thanks I'm for not leaving us high and dry. I'm surprised you didn't get sent home. I mean, my bosses are the same way, but I'm They're not... They're not going to send me home. My bosses are the same way. I think if it They're was... They're not sending me home. Never said it was funny, D. I'm just saying. He's like, thank you for coming in, because you're sick. Thank you for not, like, leaving us high and dry. Yeah. I wanted to go home, but then my car But they would understand if you, if you wake up tomorrow feeling like crap, and you're like, I'm not going to work. They would understand? Probably. But I'm still going in anyway, because I don't have time to take off. Uh. And even if I, I stay mean, home, I still have to get up early. I can't even sleep. You know. Yeah, but the kids go to school and then you can go back to sleep. No. Here's the thing. You can get up with the kids and I can sleep. Me? Really? Yeah, you. I want to work. Exactly. But you, you can at least take our son to school. I do that. I, was, I, do, I am doing that. What are you talking about? I don't know. I don't know either. I... I knew I was. I took him to school this morning. Yeah. Well, also, I'm still going to work tomorrow. It's not like I give him. We a need ten, the money. A ten dollar bill and say, "Hey, kid, call call a cab." What's up, Mario? <laughs> well, no. <laughs> What's up, Richard? Also, they have like that little app now for your kids. Poor guy. There's an app where um, you can like monitor your kids if they like take like a like an Uber or whatever. Hey, Donna.
You know what I do like about doing that though? Like this morning, I took Hacky to work. I wasn't happy about it. Yeah, well, you didn't have a choice. I was late too. I, I was running late. And then I think he kind of realized, like, after he found out I was sick, oh, this bitch is late because she's sick. Yeah. What's up, Mr. Dave? Oh, wow. Yeah, Kaggy woke me up. She goes, You got to take me to work. I'm like, oh. Hey, Munchkin. I took Kaggy to mouth. work. And I knew if I got home as soon as possible, <coughs> I could still lay down for like 45 minutes to an hour. And um, that's what I did. Oh my gosh, my mouth really? Farrah's eighth grade graduation. High school, here she comes. Oh wow. Oh, oh my god, I can't imagine. Eighth grade, I thought she was older than that. No, her son's older than that. Yeah. Eighth grade dance, wow. I remember my eighth grade dance. Many, many, many years ago. <laughs> You got a lot of beef on that hamburger. There's um, there were six burgers all together, but they're smash burgers, so they're not. I'm leaving this table full tonight. Nope. Get down. Nope. Lucky <sighs> is just like all over me because I'm sick. Yeah, and whenever like... anybody's sick, Lucky is just like a giant pain in the ass, and he tries to like. When yeah. you're sick. And like, this dog will not leave me alone. Graduation. Yeah, that's what I said. That's awesome. Lady, are you still sipping wine while you are sick? LOL. Hell I'm yes, wondering. I am. Hell yes, I am. Because that's the only thing I will sip when I'm sick. You said LOL, I would too. Hell yes. Then we're all the same people. We are the same people, and Lucky's over here. Lucky freaking scratched the crap out of me earlier. Make, yeah, it makes you feel slightly better, though. Actually, Lady and Jess, my best friend and I, we call it wine therapy. It's wine therapy. When you're sick, you just sip wine until you feel better. Don't know if I feel better just yet, so I'm going to keep sipping. I'm going to sip till I feel better. <sighs> oh my goodness, I'm full. Might be next week, but... No, you'll be good by tomorrow. I think <sighs> you'll be good by Saturday. I uh, Hopefully I am. What's up, Hydro? Hell yes. That's what I like to hear. Hell yes. You know, whenever Kagi gets sick... Thank you, Terry Kagi always Arsman. says to you guys... Jamie never gets sick. I and mean, then Jamie gets sick the next couple of days. No. Do I have a playlist? No. One time I had a cold and I drank three glasses of wine and felt great. That's what I'm saying. Wine therapy. My best, me and my best friend have this whole thing. It's like, yeah, we don't feel good. We're just going to drink some wine. Hopefully we feel better. <laughs> Happy belated birthday, Jamie. Hi, Kagi. Hello, David. Thank you. Hello. How are you? I'll tell you one thing. This week did shoot by quick. Well, yeah, it did because it was like a half a week almost. Cause, like, I was only off on Monday. Yeah, we were, both, we were both off on Monday. Actually, I was off Tuesday and Wednesday. So, yeah, this week shot by. Especially for me. Please stop. I know you're cute, but you scratched the crap out of me. You scratched the crap out of me. Please stop. Wine therapy. Love it. Yep, wine therapy. It's a whole thing. It's a whole thing, Jess. Look into it. <laughs> so what do you call wine therapy when you're not sick? Um, that's called mental health awareness. Okay. <laughs> well, I wasn't sure. I didn't that's know called, Katie, you need to make, you make yourself about, I all about that, Katie. <laughs> very aware of your mental health. <laughs> mental health awareness when you're not sick. 
My milk, you need to rest. And no interruptions. Yeah, well, that's not going to happen. That's not going to happen. <clears throat> Hello, Kelly. Hello, Kelly. Thank you. Oh, my goodness. This hit the spot. Please stop. Oh, my God. He's hurting me. Lucky, stop. <laughs> you like that one? Yeah. That's what we call it. Uh, life here in California. Same old, same old. Same thing with us in New York. Yeah. Please, no, 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 stop. Oh my God. He's being annoying. I just have this and then we get in there. Like he's scratch, he's scratching the crap out of my leg. Stop. I usually do. Talk to the hand. That's what I then, did. Yeah, just hold, if you hold it there. But I do, and then he like maneuvers. Get the idea. No, he does not. He just keeps going for it. Ugh. Mm, it's okay, Kelly. Thank you, though. I, I thank you for telling me to feel better. I appreciate it. I knew what you meant, though. It's all good. Time for my refill night, y'all. All right, good night, lady. Good night, good night. Kaki looked at the time right before we went on live. I was, was like, excited. Oh my God, it's not even 11.30. I was like, it's almost 11.30. Oh my God, I'm so excited. Yeah, because I'm tired. Half an hour does wonders. 30 minutes does magical wonders. You have no idea. Especially yeah. when you don't feel well. You want to wrap it up? I'm if you're done. ready to wrap I can't eat anymore because I can't taste it. I'm not going to eat if I can't taste. I'm sure that's freaking delicious. Smoked cheddar cheese. I'll let you know. On a bagel. The tomato soup. Oh, I like the soup. Bagel is good though. I bet you that's good. Can't taste it though. No, it's not bad. Not bad at all. All right, we will see you guys tomorrow night for dinner. I'm doing pizza. Surprise, surprise. Um, I don't know what I'm doing. Hopefully I can taste, because if I can't taste, I'm not eating. There you go. That'll be just me tomorrow night. Yeah, if I can't eat tomorrow and I can't taste, I won't be here. So. My dad was better the second day, so hopefully Kagi's feeling better uh, tomorrow. This is the second day. So tomorrow is the third day. Uh, it, should be, it should be good. Thank you for the gift. Oh, uh, thank you very much for the galaxy, Wendy. Thank we you very much. Well, um, That was awesome. We'll see you guys tomorrow night. Thank you for hanging out with us. Yes, thank you for listening to me complain and whine. Thank you. Appreciate it. Mm -hmm. I know it's good. Right. Good night, good night. Have a good night, guys. <laughs>